I'm Zoya Lashansky, and this is Slideshow, a series of highlights from conversations with interesting Buffalo creatives. It's been my biggest hobby since, like, for as long as I can remember. My parents and my grandparents always were super supportive, always encouraged me to be creative. And then after college, it got more into the business side of it. I started selling on Etsy and then I've just branched off from there. For watercolor, I start on my iPad, I sketch with an eye pencil and procreate. So I get everything ready and then I print it out and trace it onto watercolor paper. I usually have to wait until it's evening or nighttime. I need like good lighting and good vibes. And then I paint and that is usually done in an hour or two. And then I scan it in and edit in Photoshop. Ever since I was in high school, I wanted to move into the city. And that's really reflected in my earlier work doing a lot of Buffalo skylines and maps. In the last like year or two, I want to buy a house like in the woods near the coast. And so I see that reflected with a lot more like nature inspired pieces. I have always been interested in art, always drawn since I was little. As far as the process of actually making a painting, I mostly try to plan out each layer because with watercolor, you can either start from the back forward or the front back. And that's like, if you want the lighter colors in the front, you work forward backwards. That's my favorite is to work from the front to the back. It's like, instead of painting over something, you're leaving it empty and you're painting behind it. Most of my paintings have some kind of water in them. But I like to throw in like a little bit of unrealistic stuff in there. So like nature, but with weird colors. I've just noticed a pattern of little baby steps to some of my favorite pieces, which I don't, you don't know until you're done. You're like, oh, that came out. Where did that come from? I don't even know where that came from. And then I find all these little paintings. I was like, ah, I was working up to it. I didn't know. Yeah, all those little, you know, seemingly dumb drawings and stuff, they all add up. 